Vagabond is sailing. I got the main sheet out. I just left out of House of Boats, going out the Intercoastal. I got a lot of room out here in the West Bay. Uh, anyway, I got the motor on and I'm only running about uh, uh, 1500 RPM, 1600 RPM. And with the mainsail up, I'm get, still getting 5.8 knots. So, uh, it's, it's a nice, perfect day out here. Breezy and not too rough, but two to three foot, uh, two foot swells. And we're rolling, baby. I cannot believe it. There's a picture of uh, Vagabond going Sailing's first time in a long time. And then there's a barge behind me. There's House of Boats way back, way back there. Uh, about a mile now. And uh, this is Espiritu Santo Bay to the right. West Matagorda Bay to the left. Copano, Copano Bay. And then West Matagorda Bay. And then East Matagorda Bay. I'm going to go to uh, Port O'Connor tonight, park, and then go from there. So very good. Rockport. More later. Okay, I got to get a shot of the main sheet. Oh my gosh, look at that, look at that baby, look at that baby, he's full baby, full, <laughs> this dude is sailing, look at that sheet, just a power, power baby, power, fantastic. Today is Sunday, July the 12th, 2014. We just left Port O'Connor, just past the jetties at Port O'Connor. We're heading uh, east across Matagorda Bay, and then we'll cross the, uh, the uh, Colorado River Locks, and then from there we'll be in Sargent, go to Sargent, where we will be staying for a while, a few days and then we'll be going on into Freeport. But right now, we have no wind this morning. Uh, we're turning, got the screw set or the engine running at 2,000 RPM, getting uh, 6.5, 6.4, so I am picking up some wind. It's just now starting to take a, we'll get a little air. So 6.4, 6.3 at 2,000 RPM with a very light, very light breeze. Maybe five, six, seven knots. Okay, more later. Okay, today is Thursday, July the 17th, 2014. Uh, it's in the evening about uh, going on uh, almost eight o'clock. We've been parked here since Monday, July the 14th, and um, we're gonna finish painting the cabin top, not the deck, but the cabin top. Put one coat, and then we're gonna head for the marina, Bridge Harbor Yacht Marina, Saturday morning, because the Swing bridge and sergeant is damaged by has been damaged by a huge barge just tore out like one half of the uh, small boat pass through and this is the location we've been at for the past four days. We arrived here Monday afternoon 
Uh, that's the Gulf of Mexico over there. You can see it. There's a shrimp boat out there. Uh, wind's blowing 25 knots or more. It's been a nice hot day. This is where Vagabond is. This is where the barges tie up. Now, split apart a two, a multiple barge. You know they'll tie two or three barges together and make one break to go line. Well, what they do is on the other side there's another place just like this, and so they leave one barge there and you come through with a one barge and they park it here, and then they go back and get the other barge. And then they bring it to the bridge. It's very narrow. And, and hook them back up again and keep on their way. Um, there's a lot of barge traffic on the ICW here. The swing bridge is damaged, and so they're going to close it down Monday, July the 21st. So I've got to get this boat over to Bridge Harbor. Or I'm going to be stuck here for another five days, and I don't want to do that. I want to get it in its berth and relax a little bit. <laughs> oh boy! Yeah, it's been a it's been a duel. This has been a real duel, but you know I think it's worth it. I really do. And uh, I want to thank all of you for watching, and we're going to continue on. Next uh, segment will be. Life at the Bridge Harbor Dot Club in Freeport, Texas, 2014. Thank you for watching. the marina that's on this side of the bridge that's the bridge over the intercoastal waterway the ICW highway 332 Texas highway 332 that crosses over the surf side and that's a nice little um, bait and restaurant and seafood place you can buy seafood shrimp, etc. And a pretty nice place right there. And here's the bridge. Okay, this is Bridge Harbor. This is Vagabond's new home. We're over idling over.
Today is Monday, July the 21st, 2014. I have parked Vagabond in her new slip. And there she is right there. The yellow bimini. The yellow cell cover. And I have a new tan cell cover, which I haven't put on yet, but I will. And there she is with her beautiful bottom job, her top side paint, and I'm very, very satisfied that she's finally parked and, and happily resting in a nice, safe place. What's nice about this marina is Bridge Harbor, and there's the Vagabond right there. You walk out, you come up, and here's the men's restroom and then here's the ladies over there and we have a laundromat and the restrooms are very nice and we're done ice is only a dollar and 49 cents for a 20 pound bag which is very good very good and then here's the showers. I am very, very happy with this location. That's fantastic. The rent's only $235 a month. And it's a very nice facility. And the owner is putting in lot of money. He's a new owner and he's redoing it and fixing it up very nice. And as you can see it's a large marina. Lots of boats. Lots and lots of boats. It has a swim up bar swimming pool. A Jimmy Buffett themed grill on the first floor. <laughs> 